All right, so apparently uh, a lot of people thought that the video on screen right now, titled Car Mechanic Simulator 2018, Interior and Body Work Personal Project. A lot of people thought that that was supposed to be, I guess, like some sort of demonstrational video on the interior and body work. And it totally was not, um, I was kind of just messing with the game, doing my own little project there. But, uh... We are about to get into some of that. So, uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's hop on into the game and I'm actually going to show you guys some of the interior and body work going on. All right, so welcome back. It's been a while. Mossy Games here and we've got some car mechanic simulator 2018. And I'm going to show you guys a little bit about the interior and exterior work. So, as you can see, we've got a Jeep Cherokee right here that I've built. I've had in the parking garage for a while now. So, we've got the interior detailing toolkit, which some of you will probably want to use as well. So, let's go ahead and get into it. Um, I got some extra parts from another uh, project I'm working on, but... As far as this video goes, we're just going to need the Jeep Cherokee uh, front left fender C and we have a leather seat and then we have a wheel. And I'm going to show you guys uh, how to swap all of these parts. So as far as the, uh, the fenders and the doors and stuff like that, it's fairly easy. You're just going to, of course, you walk up to it. Um, hold to take it off and then when you want to put a part on you must have that part in your inventory but when you want to put it on you right click you're gonna to go to symbol mode not interior disassemble but a symbol mode and then you'll see that lights up uh, kind of a transparent to let you know that there's a part that's supposed to be there but it's not on there so we're gonna hold our left click and then as you can see we have the original one and then we have the one that I just bought which you can get off the tablet or you can go up to the computer whichever you prefer so we're gonna throw this one on and all we have to do to throw that it on is click on it down here and then we'll click on it up here boom and you pretty much do that with uh, all the parts the uh, the front all these parts that can come off the doors and all that and so for the the next part we have the seat and the wheel we're gonna do that real quick we're gonna open that door we're not gonna hold it so it takes it off we're just gonna click left click real quick and then uh, we have access to the inside of the vehicle so every time I look at something like the front left seat steering wheel front right seat it, it lights up so you have two choices you can sit down which you just click on it but instead of doing that we're gonna we're gonna just look at one of these parts let's say let's do the seat look at the seat we're gonna right click and then we're gonna go to interior disassemble so we want to change out the steering wheel and we want to change out the seat so we're gonna click on one of these not click on it we're gonna look at it and then we're gonna hold left click and it's gonna take it off hold left click same with the steering wheel and it's going to take it off now from here as long as you have the parts in your inventory we're going to right click again and we're going to go over to this green icon the interior is symbol and you see it goes to the transparent once again uh, which meaning there needs to be a part right there but there's not so we need to put our new parts on here our new seat our new steering wheel so let's see here Let's hold this. We're gonna hold left click to mount. We got our old avalanche seat. And then we've got our new leather seat that we were wanting to put in, the tan leather seat. So we're gonna click on that tan. We're gonna click on the tan one up here. Boom, it's popped in. As long as this is still transparent, you're good. If you if you walk around, you'll get out of it, and all you're gonna need to do is uh, just look at the seat or, or, or anything really. Uh, right click, go to interior symbol, and then right click again and go back to uh, interior symbol. So you're gonna go to interior disassemble, my bad, and then assemble. So the steering wheel, we're gonna 
hold the left click on that once again we got our old steering wheel we just took off and we got our new one that we bought at the, uh, the little market the store whatever so we're going to click on it up here and boom you got the steering wheel so we got we just replaced uh the seat we took the old seat out put a new one in and we took the old steering wheel out and put a new one in now in most cases uh after that you're just going to go to normal mode and you're back to normal and shut the door voila most cases um when you have a job that you have to clean up the interior or whatever you can also use this and it'll kind of it'll repair all of the interior parts or if you're like me most of the time what I did was I would just buy brand new parts from the store I of course you're not gonna make as much profit but as I got more and more money I wasn't really worried about it so that's what I did but in the very beginning this thing uh, will really come in handy for you so yeah that's pretty much it that's the interior that's the the uh, the exterior parts um, the detailing toolkit don't forget about that and should be good you got any other questions just leave them in the comments uh, any other videos uh, you guys want me to do uh, we can do that too but uh until next time i am out of here